Hello everyone. In this video, we will learn about the natural language processing feature available with Power BI. Now this feature is available on Power BI Cloud and not on Power BI Desktop. Second, as far as I'm aware, this is at the moment available only in English. So what does natural language processing mean? It means that instead of writing SQL or any other programming language, you can type your query in plain English and Power BI will give you multiple graphs and give you an ability to analyze the data. So I've got this sales data. So I've, what I've got is the global music industry sales data. As you can see, it's the ranking of the country, the sales, the year. And I've uploaded this data into my, into my data set. So I'll just remove this and let's do this again quickly. And I'll remove this as well. And let's just get the data. So it's on my local machine. I'll just open the CSV file. And as you can see, it's imported the data set. And now I can ask questions. So I can say sales. So it gives me the sales, total sales. I can say sales by country. And it gives me the sales. And let's say I want to see country by sales by country by year. And you can see it's giving me a table with this information. Let's say I want to see a map so I can put the geographic uh, element first and say country, sales, year. It's not really, but country, sales, and, and it gives me that, you can see here, it tells me that US is number one and then Japan is number two, and let's see which country is number six. Seems to be Australia. So yeah, you can you can see all of this, and uh, it's a very interesting feature. You don't have to write any any programming language, and you can just type plain English, and get multiple options, and. So you can, it even gives me the ability to select the sales for United Sales States by, let's say by year. And I'm quite excited with this feature and I hope you find this video useful. Thanks for watching this video.